Hi there, and welcome to another pencast for the course Reasoning and Logic. This one is also about division into cases. In fact, we take another look at the proof we did in one of the previous pencasts. You may remember that with this proof of this uh, claim that n to the third plus 3n squared plus 2n is divisible by 3 for all integers. And the proof was quite lengthy and it involved a lot of algebra. Well, in this pencast, I'm going to show you that sometimes doing a little bit of work before you start can save you a lot of work in the big run. We can do a bit of algebra on this first term, and we can see that we can factor out an n, and an n plus 1, to finally get n times n plus 1 times n plus 2. And if we now do the exact same proof as we did before, we split out k into three different cases, 3n, 3n plus 1, and 3n plus 2, you'll see that every case becomes a lot easier by just having done this little bit of work beforehand. So if we compare the two proofs, well, I've left out a little bit of the formality in the one above, but you can see that it's quite a bit smaller and also, perhaps more importantly, takes a little bit less algebra to do than the one that we did before. So sometimes doing a bit of algebra before you start your proof can save you a lot of time when doing the proof. Simplify expressions then start proving them. That would be my advice. See you around.